So what do you think of Eduardo? Uh, so far, I'm just ready for the fight, feel good. Yeah, ready to go. That's all I can say. Yes, you know, it's like uh, me training, I don't train for an opponent. I train myself, seeing myself in future, what I'm gonna achieve. So all these guys, they just like, that, that's why I always cry for fights. Like, please give me a fight, give me a fight. I don't care who, who whatever. Anytime I'm ready. So for me, it was just like a delay for getting this fight, like delaying me, delaying me. But I'm ready for any fight, anytime. That's who I am. I grew up in Zimbabwe, uh, Gokwe, in a rural area. So growing up, weeding, going, doing peace jobs. When I came here, I was working in a construction site. Then I, uh, uh, there was a moment I could see EFC. I'm like, I work, I can do this. I used to fight beating guys at school and it was better for me. I think that's my talent and I liked it. Then it becomes a thing that brings food on the table. So now it's a job. It's not like a hobby. So that's why I take this thing seriously. And I don't train like others who like, I train, it's, it's my hobby. Me, I train it because I know that's the thing that puts food on the table. So that's why I take it very serious. And when I'm training, I'm ready to kill someone for that. You're ready to kill someone? Someone will go down if you play games. <laughs> and is that your mentality when you go into fight Eduardo In my fight, I'm like, there is no way I will lose. I'm here for this. So I have to make sure that the job is done. There is no way I'll take it like, uh, even if I'm smiling, I'm like, I have to win. There is no way I have to win. That's, that's my mentality. So it's the thing. So have you seen any of Eduardo's fights in the past? I've seen some kickboxing fights. He's a good fighter. He's a good stand-up fighter. I don't know if he learned ground game as well. Like me, I had an opportunity to learn from Demart, Temba, Sylvester. Sylvester is a kickboxer. He's a wrestler as well. Dimat is a wrestler, is a stand-up fighter. Temba is a wrestler, is a stand-up fighter. So I've seen the way they trained. I trained with them. I combine that. That becomes me. So I'm ready for anything. To put it in a simple time, I can say, I fought for myself first. Then if people like me, then I'm ready to fight for them too. That's who I am. Me first. <laughs> <laughs> So far, I've yet to find someone who's gonna take, put me to my limits. Like, I want someone who will fight me. Someone that I will feel like, we are, this was a fight. And then I will be able to share everything I got with that person. I'm sure Barros is ready and um, he's a stand up fighter, and I'm also a stand up fighter. So I will give him the best of the matches. So I don't want him to fall down quickly. I want him to stand. I hope he's gonna stand because I wanna give my best. I wanna give my best shots on him for people to see that, like, wow, this guy can punch, this guy can fight, this guy can kick. So I'm willing to give everything for the people. What can Eduardo Barros expect from you in three weeks time? Um, a big fight. If you're willing to take it, I uh, must expect a big fight because it's not gonna be just a small fight or an easy fight for him. It's gonna be a very hectic fight for him because um, I've been training. I'm sure he's ready because I'm always ready. And all oh, thanks to him that he, I, he, I agreed to take this fight. And um, I give credit to him that he's a man. He's a real deal. And I wish him good luck 